Hello everybody, welcome to episode 46 of Randonautica. Now the intent for this one is Hidden Doorway. This is another viewer intent here by Swellen or Sulin9542. I'm sorry if I murdered your name again, but uh, yeah, Hidden Doorway. I have no clue what we're gonna find out here. I am very familiar with this area. We are currently in the ring right now, but uh, I used to go up here to hang out all the time. Um, have never seen anything really any different, so maybe things have changed. It's been at least like a couple of years since I've actually been out here, but uh, yeah, we're gonna look. Starting with this because I don't think this was here the last time I was here. This is like an open field thing, I guess, for this, but. This was all like, it used to look like that, like the way that is. And now it's just an open patch. It's an interesting spot. I'm not walking that way, that's looking like tick heaven. It's over here. dead end there yeah, there's an area me and my friends used to hang out up there in the woods when we were younger which is why I'm like super familiar with this area <laughs> plus I also used to live in this town so but as for like items or doors or whatever it is. I'm not finding anything. Just taking a check, a little peek over here, but. No, the radius is pretty big. Like the, the last part of it's like right over there, which we'll go in a sec. But uh, I figure I'd check over here because you never know. And it's the only opening I see because I'm not walking over there because that's all like, I don't want a chance ticks or anything. Eh, the sun's coming out. This is like weirdly clear. So like a looks like an old a very old campfire type thing it looks like somebody stacked this years ago like a very long time ago actually but uh it seems to end here and I'm not walking down that because it just rained yesterday and I will not be able to walk down there without busting my ass. So that's not happening. I don't, yeah, I don't see anything down there. But, uh, I don't think this is, I don't think we're seeing anything to be honest. I see something right over there. I have no clue what that is. It's way across there. I don't know if you can see it. It's like a black like circular looking thing but I'm pointing right at it I don't but I don't see I don't know if you guys could see that um but that's all the way across the river I don't know if I feel like checking that out but uh okay hidden doorway it's not a doorway but there's like a hidden message there What does it say? I went to turn around just to see if there was like anything more and then I saw this, what the hell? It says, hi, do you see me? Something, I can't even read that word. Something, yeah, something is, something not. <laughs> I 
is, is okay, go find me. I could barely make that up, but it says go, go find me or go find me or something like that, but that's weird. I don't know what we're looking for out here if there's somebody screwing with us, but come find me. I mean, I could start by looking over here because we know nothing is there. I feel like I'm geocaching right now. There's nothing there. There's like a little path over there. Maybe that's what they want me to see. So damn wet out here today. I didn't want to touch it because I didn't know if it was like baby sumac or something, but I think it's okay. Oh, this just takes you out. There's like a patch of clear. There's like a clear path over there. I'll check that out. Well, this is an easier way to get over there. I really have no clue what I'm even looking for, though. Like, if I don't find it, like, I hope you guys aren't disappointed, but, like, I'm pretty confused. <laughs> I wasn't even expecting to see anything off out here. Although I don't know how long it's been out there. I've never even really been back there myself, so I can't really say for sure. Kind of Look around. If you guys see anything that I miss, let me know down in the comments. I'm just kind of skimming by until I see something. There's something there. What is this? Looks like a whole bunch of metal. There's a symbol. I don't know if that's what we were trying to find, but I haven't had really anything involved with the symbols lately like that. Now, mind you, I do come across those symbols, but they're in like random spots, so I don't know what to think of them. But I don't know if that's what this was trying to take me to come out and find, but funny enough, that's an old door right there. There's nothing under it, but it's just a, like a metal door. So maybe that's a hidden door. That's, I mean, it's not the most interesting thing in the world, but I'd say it sort of checks out. It's just a little weird. That's a cool web. Now let me show you guys. Looks like a whole bunch of Spider-Man type webs. I don't know if you caught it. Or not caught it, but... I don't know if you can see it on camera. I hope the camera caught it, but... The sun's like reflecting off of them. It's a piece of trash. You never know. Good, always good to check. But... I see some stuff over there. This is, this is just a weird one. I'm just gonna be flat out honest. This is very weird.
Looks like some old railroad uh, wood pieces, like very old ones. And this is weirdly flat. Maybe it just looks like this, but he's got like a very square incline. It's strange. I'm gonna try and I'm seeing a little bit more stuff over there. I'm gonna try to get out, but as soon as I step over there, I'm not really in the point anymore. But I mean, there could be things that have kind of went with it. I don't know. But we're gonna take a look. It just seems like a lot of really old like parts and stuff. Maybe that was a piece of a door, but it's just metal paneling. And I'm not looking to cut myself on it. <laughs> Especially with all that rust. I'm good on that. It's like an old pot or something. Um, I mean, yeah. That's all I could really find. It's not the most interesting thing in the world. I don't even know if that's what we were, we were trying to even find. But. I don't know guys. Let me know if you saw anything. Like. There's um. The only interesting thing. Really about this area that I know of. Is this right here. It uh. What it is now is the water comes out of it. It's just like an area to like, it's connected to the sewage system now, so it drains everything down in there, which is absolutely disgusting. But uh, this right here, before it was that, used to be a mine. And I remember coming here a very long time ago. We were actually trying to see if maybe it was paranormal. We were using this app and I'm gonna be dead honest. I'm very skeptical about the apps. I don't think they're legit. And the, the, the app we were using was um, Necrophonics, but I really don't know what to think of the app. I think it's bogus. Now, I could be wrong, and if I'm proved wrong, great, because then we were getting like genuine stuff, but this is like also an original point, I'm sorry for it's a bit loud, but you can kind of see down in there. And somebody was trying to go fishing there. But yeah, this this was once a mine. I don't know what the m name of the mine it was, but I was told by a lot of the people that have been down here for years that this was a mine, which I think is pretty cool, but I'm gonna see you guys in the second stage, and holy crap, that sun is bright. Um, Yeah, again, not the best location, but we did find a door hidden out there, even if it was a piece of trash. And we found, I guess, a hidden message. I don't know if that's what it was trying to have us find. But, uh, again, let me know what you guys think. I will see you guys at the second location. Hello, everybody. We are currently at our second location. The intent for this one is past and present. Now, I already know exactly where we are. This is a very cool spot. Um, Randonautica took me 
to a location that uh, basically is part of my childhood, technically. Um, me and all of my friends, we used to always come out here, hang out. We used to make weapons and stuff, like, for fun. Like, we used to, like, we built a forge, which <laughs> I'll get to that in a sec. That's uh, crazy when you're about to see it. Um, there's, I'll tell you the story behind that and everything when we get over there. But, uh, yeah, we used to, like, melt metal and make, like, spears and swords and axes. Um, it was a lot of fun. We used to just, like, take pieces of, of metal from the woods and bring them up here. Lug them up here and just go to town. But, uh, I noticed that bike down there. Um, I don't know if it's the same bike from years ago, but, uh, that's actually a friend of ours bike. And they brought it up here and we decided one day that, uh, I don't, I don't I actually don't remember whose idea it was, but, um, one of them decided to just trash it on them, which isn't really cool, but, uh, they just started using that for up here. Um, so the, the whole front tire is even there anymore. I don't even think the handlebars are there anymore, but you can see the back tire. I'll even, hopefully you guys can see that. It's a little, it might be a little camouflage for you guys. Hopefully it's not. But um, now we get over here. And this is our stone forge that we, we made out of like, out of stone and mud. Um, you can see all the metal scrap that we used to use. Uh, it looks like nothing now, but it, was, but it was a lot better back then. And it's very rusty now, you can't even, I don't even think you could, I mean, you could probably fix the metal, but like this, I'm pretty sure, I think one of us turned this into something, I don't quite remember, but it's like, it's like not even anything anymore. It just looks like a normal piece of metal. But, um, yeah, so under this, there was like a metal plate. On top of that metal plate, we had like this grill rack. And then we enclosed it with rocks and, and mud. And then, uh, so basically what we did from there is we would just keep tossing in as much flammable shit as possible. We used to burn a lot of things back then. We used to also do a lot of stupid stuff regarding that, but um, we used to just let it burn until it got like thousands of degrees. And then we would bring in this like makeshift crucible that we made and we would just melt the metal in it. And then we would bring it on top of a, a rock and then we would just hammer the shit out of it. <laughs> Like, we wouldn't like do it till it was liquefied, but till it was, like, red. And then we would just, like, hammer it until it, like, got sharpened. But, um, yeah, so there's that. How it looks like this is actually our doing, or more like my brother's doing. One day we decided it was a good idea to burn a tire. This is after all of our friends moved away. We came out here, we're burning this tire, and, um, we didn't realize that the tire... We didn't realize that rubber and tires were super flammable and didn't know how to get put out. And so we're, put, we're, we're running up and down from the river, putting the fire out. We're hearing fire truck sirens. We're like, oh shit, we're, we keep running and trying to put out the fire. We Anyway, we finally put it out after like a whole hue of black smoke is up above us and we just get the hell out of there. But um, yeah, that was the last of the forge after that. And then we made a new one down there, which is no more. Somebody somebody came and wrecked that on us. It literally doesn't exist anymore. There's like maybe a little bit of ash from back then, and that's about it. But down here, last but not, we, or yeah, I guess last but not least. Um, oh yeah, we also used to make these like walls, which was a pain in the ass. We wanted to like kind of make it look nice, like decorate it a little bit, but it doesn't really look like anything anymore because I mean, I, it's been years, obviously. You can see how there's a freaking tree growing out of it now, the forage. But uh, here, I'll show you guys in a sec when I can actually traverse through this. Oh, and that's another thing too. What actually made us stop coming out here, these trees, 
they were also obviously the trees are back you wouldn't you wouldn't know any different probably but unless you've actually seen it for yourself all these trees were cut down they were gonna cut it down and i think they were gonna like zone it this area or something like that and then i guess they decided not to but then um so for whatever reason they decided not to and then the trees grew back and so it looks like nothing ever happened here which is a little trippy because it was like like this place changed <laughs> we to us like we just stopped coming out here after that <laughs> that was probably like actually that was probably like a little bit before we started the channel actually like it's been that long but uh the last thing I want to show you guys is over here once I could get over there without busting my ass I wanted to show you guys this so people like us come out here and do this stuff now I don't it's not a forge I don't think or it's definitely not a forge I think it's like a little oven where maybe somebody was cooking their food on top but I thought that was really cool like people are still coming out here and like it's just crazy whoever came out here was like who did that so it's like the next person just took over after us that's that's literally how long it's been since we've been out here but um I just wanted to show you guys that. If I find anything else that uh, I want to bring up in the video, just to, to show for the sake of remembrance, because literally Randonaka took me all the way out here. But um, I'll see you guys at the final location. That's that's pretty cool, actually. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys then, or until we find something more that may add on to this or something. I don't know yet, but uh, I'll see you guys then. <laughs> Hello everybody, we are currently our, at our final location. The intent for this one is Decay. This is a, another viewer intent by uh, Sue Allen. I forgot the numbers, but uh, it'll be up on the screen the first time I mentioned him, so you guys should understand. But uh, yeah, our point is literally right there and it's actually something really cool and something that I was never able to explore back in the day, actually, because this was all blocked off. Now, if we explored this back in the day, this would be an OG area. Unfortunately, it's not. This is considered new, which is actually kind of funny because if we filmed it back then, like I said, this would be like, this would have been like one of our very first videos because we were amateurs at the time and we were just taking any little piece of abandon we could find. Like, I'm, I'm not even kidding you. This would have probably been like a, a five minute video. Five minute to two minute video, but uh, yeah, I noticed it and saw that there was like a little path behind it, behind that porta potty here, and yeah, so you have this. I'm actually probably gonna make this a thumbnail. Ooh. But, uh, yeah, guys, there's some symbols in here, but the intent checks out completely, like, decay. It's really cool. <laughs> like, I never got to go in here after all these years, and now it's, there's a clearing in it, and now I'm able to actually get in. I have no clue what this building used to be at all. I don't know the history on this building but it's a cool find it looks like people used to hang out inside of it or you could definitely tell people hung out in here it's actually nice and cool inside i might take a short break in here just be, it's got natural air conditioning it's like pretty nice but uh yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video um check out definitely <laughs> Oh, I'm still pretty happy I was able to get in this place. Wait. Oh, shit. 
I'm not touching that because I don't know. That could be bad crap, but I think this is wood. It's like really old wood. Yeah, it is. That's it's actually pretty cool. I thought there was a hole in the roof. That's a stone, though. But uh, anyway, back to the outro. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, check out the Instagram, um, Discord, and the new Facebook group. Uh, if you guys want to uh, better support us as well, go to the Patreon as well. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. We will see you guys in the next video, and goodbye.